we are we are super excited we just got a big box of awesomeness we cannot wait to share this with you guys what's in the box and it is part of the mother load there's still quite a load yet to arrive but this is part of it and we're just really excited it's gonna be a good school year somehow we're gonna get it all done three kids kindergarten first grade third grade and we're gonna just knock it out of the park this year aren't we guys yeah, yeah. Yep, we're gonna knock it out of the park. Welcome to my channel. This is Rouse Rising and I'm Katie and this is Annika. Today we have for you an unboxing of our homeschool library. We ordered this all at once for all three kids for this year and I'm just going to go through real quick what all we got for them and put it on the bookshelf behind me. This bookshelf we have empty for homeschool supplies. We have a whole nother bookshelf full of books. Um, but this one's going to be dedicated just to their homeschool library and their homeschool workbooks. This one? Okay, my assistant, Annika, is going to be handing me the books, apparently. So we'll just go in no particular order. We have the Lord of the Rings box set. The Hobbit, the first book. We got... Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring, Lord of the Rings, The Two Towers, and The Return of the King. So excited about reading these together as a family. This one's yours. This is the Usborn 10 Minute Stories. Yep. Now let me see. We got this one to read aloud. Okay. We have Stepping Stones, The Minstrel in the Tower, we have the Super Solar System, Little Butterfly, Ponies, Thomas Edison and His Big Idea, Space. Rocks and fossils. Ponies. Alright, go sit down. We got monster bugs. Awesome. Amazing armadillos. Twister. These are science books. Oh, Twister's cool. Molly of Denali. I thought we got more of these, but maybe our whole order isn't in. And our homeschool curriculum is late, obviously, because there's a lot of people homeschooling this year. So everything's back ordered. So hopefully we get that in the next couple weeks. All right. We have Ice Mummy. More science. Ice Mummy. Magic Treehouse. We got the complete, the complete Magic Treehouse set. Books, well, books 1 through 28 anyways. So we got those up there for my brother. My brother said this wrong, but a giant magnifying glass. And it's in this world. We got quite a few um, space books. We got Torsten, he got the Phonics Star Wars Lego Reader Starter Pack. That's mine. Can you can get up closer. Oh, we got Riker and the kids, a STEM activity that we will do probably over Christmas break. 
It's awesome. Oh, I also got Torsten and Hagen Annika Animal Phonics Readers. We got a set of boxcar children. It says the complete five book mini series. So this was this was something that I read when I was a kid. So I thought it would be fun to either read aloud with the kids or when they are able to read these on their own, they can work through reading these. Another series of books that I read when I was in school, like elementary school. I'm pretty sure I read all this in elementary school, but is the Little House box series. So this is Little House Big Adventure. Okay, this is the Little House box set. And Little House in the Big Woods, Farmer Boys on the Banks of Plum Creek, Little House on the Prairie by the Shores of Silver Lake, The Long Winter, Little Town on the Prairie, these happy golden years and the first four years. Super excited about reading these. Yeah. I will be reading these out loud this year to the kids, so we'll work our out our way through those. I don't recall ordering this. Edward Hager's Tales of Magic. Magic of the Garden, Magic by the Lake, Knight's Castle, and Half Magic. We got the Ready to Read Beginning Reading Level 1 6 book set. The sun, snow, rainbow, rain, clouds, wind, sun. Okay, so back to the beginning. And those will be good. They'll go along with our science lessons. Got Hagen some fun books to read. She got the Amelia Bedelia series, beginning level one reading. Came with five books. Five books. Also got her Annie and Snowball. She ha they actually have a little stuffed animal that they carry around named Snowball. It's a little T.Y. Beanie reindeer baby and it is the cutest thing. All the kids have loved it so I got her that box set. They'll like reading that. Another solar system book. Ooh. Rocks and fossils. Us born how things work. Got the kids a magnifying glass. This is by STEM Squad, Flood, Race Against Time. This is also STEM Squad, Blackout, Danger in the Dark. We got a solar system kit. We're gonna build the solar system mobile. It's awesome. And then this STEM robotics kit. Yeah. This winter we will try to build a robot. We also got this box set of Pinkalicious, the I Can Read Level 1, Pinkarama. I think that does it for our library book. Paul. I will list as many as I can of these box sets up here. Uh, this is for like elementary school age up to about fifth or sixth grade. Even adults can read some of these books. They're just real wholesome good books. So I will definitely link those box sets down below and then I will link some of these easy reader books down below. A lot of those. Just little informational books about different topics. So those are always interesting. The kids have a bunch of those already. We will be sure to put all of our school age books on this bookshelf. Oh, this is Snowball. So Hagen just brought over Snowball. This is their toy Snowball. I believe she needs a bit of a patch done. Or one of her hooks. 
And so, yeah, this is your snowball. And if we can ever find another one of these, we're going to have to buy all of the ones that they have in stock because this is a very loved stuffy. You want to show them your stuffy? Uh-oh. Oh, say, here's my stuffy snowball. So all the kids have treated snowball like a baby over the years. They got this from their mama. She sent it probably when Micah was a baby. And so they've just really loved the stuffy. It has been through the wash so many times. It's losing all of its fuzz. Snowball! <laughs> yeah. I will open it in just a minute. So we have to get all these books back on the bookshelf. I think that sums it up for right now. When we get our homeschool curriculum, I will be sharing that with you all as well. We'll let you know what we got. We do homeschool through the county, so we are provided a stipend, and we also get to order between non-secular kids. There's a couple homeschool items I will be purchasing that do not come from the school. I would like to incorporate a little bit of the good and beautiful into our curriculum, but we are using a um, non-secular homeschool program for the time being. And we will share that with you guys when we get it. Thank you so much for joining us today. If you guys can, hit a like for the kids, subscribe for our family, and be sure to click your notification bell so that you can stay up to date with all of our latest videos. Thank you so much for joining us today. Bye.